Hey guys, this is Greg from MachineMasters.com and today I'm going to revisit a tutorial where I was showing people how to uh, take a piano and make it sound like a string sound. Apparently I didn't explain it too well, so I'm going to go a little slower this time. Um, hopefully more people get it. So let's go ahead and play the piano loop. And then let's go down to the MIDI editor. Now what's important is you're on straight 128 grid. That's important. Select a note and then cut on the grid. Not all DAWs have the slice to grid feature, so you're going to have to do it manually if you don't have this feature in your DAW, but that's the key right there. Then when we play it back, now let's go ahead and add another note. Some people thought it had to do with the piano's reverb, and granted, every sound that you record, every sound that's any, anywhere, has its own reverb, but the reverb that's on the sound, on the piano itself, had nothing to do um, with this effect. And I'll prove it to you here by muting notes that come post the split notes. So take a listen. Notice how it shuts off, and it's just playing the notes that are uh, below the chord, the bass notes. But when we unmute it and bring it back in, since they are the same note, the same, well not the same note, but the same acoustic properties, it just gels together. And it doesn't matter what DAW you're using. Uh, I'm in Logic, same notes, or at least the same uh, grid chops, and take a listen. So anyway, that's how that's created. Um, I hope more people got it. If you do have questions, please leave them in the comment section below. And if you have requests, also leave those in the comment section, and I will see you guys next week.